I've lived in New Braunfels most of my life. If you're curious what some of the pros and cons are to living in New Braunfels, I'm going to give you my top five coming up next. The number one pro to living in New Braunfels, in my opinion, is the small town feel. Even though this is a rapidly expanding and growing city, uh, it certainly is nothing like Austin and San Antonio, which are the two major cities that it sits in between. And it still has its German heritage history, maintains that, and has that small town vibe, which I really love. The number two thing that I love about living in New Braunfels is that even though it is a smaller city, we have all the fast food, tons of restaurants, we've got some microbreweries, wineries, there are all kinds of boutique restaurants and shops and everything uh, to enjoy right here, usually within just a couple miles of your house. The third pro is all of the outdoor recreation that New Braunfels provides. We have two rivers that are famous for tubing, which if you've never done that, uh, it is definitely a great way to relax in the summertime and we've got lakes that are just minutes away. There are lakes that were created by dams in the Guadalupe River that are right inside the city limits. And we have Canyon Lake that's just, depending on where you live, 15 to about 30 minutes away. And you can definitely go out there and enjoy all kinds of outdoor recreation. We've got parks, uh, hiking, biking, you name it. If you love being outdoors, New Braunfels is a great place to live. The number four pro to living in New Braunfels is the festivals and live music. With New Braunfels' strong German heritage, we have Wurstfest in the fall and Wasselfest in the winter. We have a Comal County Fair, and then there's also a very strong live music scene in New Braunfels with the historic district of Green where many, many artists got their uh, start in the music industry. So really great festivals and live music scene here in New Braunfels. The number five pro to living in New Braunfels is that it's very family friendly. There's activities for everyone here in New Braunfels. Whether you have young children and want to take them to the Children's Museum or you have kids that are growing up, they're going to love the summers here playing at Schlitterbahn or tubing down the river. And then we have great schools as well. And both of the high schools here in town have really strong athletic programs. It's a great place to raise a family. Well, with all the positives, there's always some negatives. So let's get into the five cons of living in New Braunfels. The number one con to living in New Braunfels would probably be the commute. If you're working in Austin or San Antonio and you're commuting to one of those cities, depending on which time of day you're commuting and where you're going in those cities could be a long commute. But I do have brothers, sisters, and friends, and clients that make that commute every day. So. There are certainly people that love New Braunfels so much that they want to live here and commute, but that can be a negative. The number two negative would probably be summer tourism. We do get a lot of traffic in the middle of the summertime, and there's a lot of people coming to enjoy all the wonderful things that we get to enjoy year round here in New Braunfels. The number three negative would probably be the rapid expansion that we're seeing in New Braunfels has created a lot more traffic. So if you've been here, for many, many years, then it's it's quite a change. So, you know, we, we are experiencing some traffic. If you've lived in a big city, then that's probably, uh, it's probably still gonna seem like light traffic, but that is one of the things that I see as, a, as kind of a con. The number four negative to living in New Braunfels would probably be the heat and humidity. If you've lived other parts of the country that have mild summers, New Braunfels could be pretty extreme. It gets very hot and humid at the same time, so, that is one of the negatives, but fortunately we have some amazing recreation to enjoy, such as the rivers and lakes. The Comal River stays a constant 72 degrees, so you can always cool off in the summertime. My final negative to living in New Braunfels is that there is no Costco yet. Now there is one 15 minutes south on I-35, and there's a Sam's Club 15 minutes north on 35, but there isn't one here. I still make the commute because it's definitely worth it, but that's, that's my final negative. So, hope you've liked this list of my five pros and cons. If you're thinking about moving to the Central Texas area, don't hesitate to reach out to me. My contact info is in the description below, and I look forward to meeting you. <laughs>